Sam Bearer here in the class winner's garage with another tech tidbit. You know, a lot of people, they're convinced there's something wrong electrically when something like a power windows or power seats don't work. Well, it can be, but it can also be mechanical, or it can be both. And that's what we found with this 1955 Ford Thunderbird with the power seat option. The seat wouldn't go back and forth, and it wouldn't go up and down. So we went looking for the electrical diagram for the 1955 Thunderbird. Took the door panels off, and what did we find? A bunch of wires were disconnected. And a bunch of wires were connected in the wrong positions. So behind this vinyl cover behind the seat are the seat relays connected to the motor. So after establishing that the wiring had been corrected, we were still just getting a click. So we undid the two bolts holding the power motor on there and voila, it actually worked. So the next step was to take apart this screw drive system. Just push out a pin there and push out a pin on top and the whole thing came out. And as it turns out, it was just stuck. So a little lube, a little cleaning, it's back together and now it works. So remember, just get a workshop manual, ask questions online, look at things logically, and just start from the beginning and go to the end. Take your time, have patience, walk away when you need to. But you will get it. And sometimes it's just an easy fix. Life's too short for ordinary cars. So get the cool ones, and enjoy the whole ownership experience with it, even when you have to fix it.